Hey, what is up guys, I'm Android Tech, and today we are going to be checking out a pretty awesome software called Phone Rescue. And essentially what this is, is a program that allows you to recover any type of file or photos and much more from your Android device or iOS device. So the website where you can get this software is called iMobi. I will have a link down below in the description of this video, so just click on the website and it'll take you automatically to the download site. So once you get to the website, as you can see, it gives you all the information, uh, what you need to know about this software and what it can do and all that. Alright, so so once you scroll a little bit down, as you can see, you have the options to uh, download it now. Or you can also buy it and uh, of course, you could also get a 60 day money free back guaranteed. So if you don't like the software, you could always, you know, get your money back. Um, so that's pretty awesome that they, you know, you have that option. So right here, here, here's all the phones that are compatible with this app or software. Um, so you, we have Samsung, uh, Sony, HTC, Google, uh, Huawei, Motorola, and LG. So I have an LG, I have the LG G4. So, so yeah, um, it's compatible with, of course, mine. So if you scroll all the way down, as you can see, here's more, um, you know, important information about this software and stuff like that, as you can see. So if you have time to read it, just read it. Um, it really helps a lot. And here you have the options to uh, download the program. So just click on download. And from right here, um, as you can see, you have the options to, so say if you have an, an iOS phone just click it just click here but since we have an Android phone we're gonna be uh, downloading it for Android and just choose your version of your phone so the brand so like I said I have an LG so I would click LG so let's click on this one download now and as you can see right here on the at the bottom is downloading and it's gonna download pretty fast in fact it's already downloaded so you want to open it up and then you install it right here and then it's going to install as you can see so right now what we actually need to do is just wait a little bit because it is installing so once it is done downloading or installing you want to click uh, start so from right here you just click the language as you can see English of course just click on save and then it's going to ask you as you can see how to quick tips on how to you know just useful tips for your phone and stuff like that just click getting started. All right guys, so now that we started the program up, it is asking me to connect the USB to the phone as you can see right here at the bottom. Um, it says please connect your device to start the recovery up. So yeah, that's required right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug the USB cable to my phone, which is the LG G4. So let me go ahead and do that right now. All right guys, so let me go ahead and plug in the USB cable. To the device all right guys so as you can see right now all right guys so right now you'll get this pop-up on your phone as you can see it says if you want the computer to get access to all your data on your phone click allow of course so over there as you can see now all right guys so once you already have it connected as you can see you get this um right here this message saying we've detected that your computer uh, doesn't install the device's driver do you want to install it uh, click OK this button right here so click OK and let's see what um, it tells us next alright guys so the reason why it was giving me that little error is because I had to go um, as you can see it gives you the instructions there um, the first thing you have to do is you have to go as you can see to about phone I don't think you could really see but let me lower down the brightness uh, right there as you can see first thing you have to do is go about font and then go to software info and then belt number and then you have to click the belt number at least 35 times and then you go to and then you will have developer options and then you have to enable USB debugging as you can see right there um, so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now alright guys so right now I'm about to go to the so you want to go to about phone and then from about phone you want to go to software info and then belt number click at least you know like I said and then as you can see you are already a developer now you want to go back and then back and then developer options and then you get this little um, warning just click don't show again and then from right here you want to click on to USB debugging so so you want to check that on right there and it's going to ask you um, you know just click OK you don't have to worry about it and then after that 
USB debugging should be um, enabled as you can see you have the little check mark right there and um, yeah alright guys so now that we have our USB debugging enabled you want to reconnect the USB cable again so like I said we're gonna have to do this process again but this time it should work with no problem so again click allow and then click OK as you can see USB debugging and then just click OK and then boom as you can see it recognized the USB debugging okay right, so as you can see it gives you this USB debugging authorization so right here as you can see it, it basically shows you how to do it so check um, always allow on your phone right here as you can see let me so check always allow and then click OK and then from right here let's see click OK right here and as you can see it says welcome to phone rescue for LG it's installing the phone rescue app to my LG right now so yeah we just gotta wait and boom as you can see it launched the app alright guys so as you can see once the phone is connected to the program um, it's all I already set up everything so right now as you can see here here is when when um, you launch the program on your PC so as, of course you have the LG phone the G4 the name of the phone stuff like that oh so yeah that's the phone that I'm currently using and connected right now so right here here's all the items that you have that you could recover from so you could recover um, your know your contacts uh, call logs messages calendar photos music videos app documents whatsapp line and all that stuff so yeah that's pretty awesome so after that you want to you know if you want to recover you know let's say your music you have to you know check that on let's uncheck all these let's just say that i deleted something on my phone being the music and after that let's click on next and then from here it's analyzing your device and as you can see right now it's requesting a permission to your device so just click allow on your device and just give it a little uh, second you know you could scan your device and here's all the music that I have on my device as you can see here's all the music that I have and say if I deleted all these are actually the music that I deleted on my phone so with this program as you can see you could get them all back the whole songs and everything like that and this works for everything like i said guys for it works for your photos videos any type of file that you have um like i said it also works for music as shown right here so as you can see um at the bottom it says you have selected 17 items to recover and if you want to recover them guys just click right here and it should recover them back to your device and if you click on it it'll you know it'll scan all the files and put them back on your device um because they were being deleted and stuff like that so that's gonna do it for this video guys if you guys liked it make sure to give it a massive thumbs up and why not subscribe to this channel if you guys want to see more great awesome content like this but that's gonna basically do it for this video guys like I said, this software link will be down below in the description of this video. So if you want to check it out, if you thought it was interested, because I know a lot of you guys do delete files on accident. And this is the perfect, you know, solution on how to get them back. Um, but yeah, like I said, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.